Jesus then, in verse 25, this is now where it picks up. Jesus calls them together and says, You know that the rulers of the Gentiles lord it over them, and their high officials exercise authority over them. Not so with you. Instead, whoever wants to become great among you must be your servant, and whoever wants to be first must be your slave, just as the Son of Man did not come to be served, but to serve and to give his life as a ransom for many. You want to go higher, go lower. Amen. If the one thing, one of the things that we, we saw through this movement that happened there in Asbury is God's looking for humility. Amen. I shared this last week. Humility, hunger, holiness. We've got to go lower and say, Lord, it's about you. Whatever God you give me, however you've wired me. Remember, you can't earn gifts. Gifts are given. God, whatever anointing you release on my life, however you would use me in this hour, God. God, I want to stay in a low place, close to you, God, so that the essence of who you are would shine through my life, that others could come to know you, and the body of Christ could be discipled and equipped to do the work of the ministry, God. I pray to God that out of the churches in America would rise up such a movement of prayer, intercession, evangelism, discipleship, that a flame of fire could not put out what God is doing in this nation. Amen. It starts with humility from the top down, but also from the bottom up because it's an upside-down kingdom. Given will be given to you. Go low to be elevated. Seek in the highways and byways, the least, the last, and the lost. Amen. 